Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, when we left off, we had just uh, cleared cleared out some um, various locations, and we are ready to move on. So, let us see. <coughs> the Iron Ram, he's level 25, and we can easily beat him. Um, let's just see. The next uh, side quest is, uh, or uh, rather, uh, side quest, I mean, main quest, is the Hyena, uh, which takes, takes us into Giza, which uh, where we are going anyway. So uh, I guess that's the next port of call. Um, but we're actually. Yeah, let's go kill the Iron Ram first and uh, pick up Reda's um, uh, daily quest. <coughs> and a few other locations along the way. So let's uh, just follow the island here to the south. <coughs> Excuse me, seem to have... Uh, gotten the cough again. A lot of gazelles were hurt in the making of this let's play. Let the uh, records show. <coughs> Oh, pelts. Let's raid this uh, trireme first. No reason not to. Oh, this is a civilian ship. Never mind. Sorry. Oh, God. These are level 30. Like uh, they're a bit too difficult. Never mind. <coughs> well, I'm going to lurk for a bit. Thanks for the stream. You are more than welcome. Thanks for joining me. <coughs> and have a good um, lurk and good night if you don't come back. Nice of you to be here as always. Oh damn it, he's moving away from me. Come back, try ream. More like by ream. Am I right? <clears throat> oh, sorry, I'm fighting this damn cough. <clears throat> this little island out, see what we can find. Or 
well, maybe not so little. <laughs> <coughs> Oh yeah, I keep forgetting goat, goats don't give anything in this game. <coughs> Sorry goats. My bad. So it looks like Half Horn is just uh, speeding away from us. Uh, <clears throat> uh, let's see, what do we want to do? He's coming back uh, eventually. But we will actually circle down. Um, yeah, let's complete this gnome. Uh, why not? Um, and let's circle back to Giza after we've done this. <clears throat> Seems like a logical, methodical thing to do. Let's just check out the various houses along the way. <clears throat> the floods have risen too high. My fields, my crops, my animals. My wife's precious jewelry box that I spent years crafting, it's all been washed away, Every, everything but the sorrow. Ah, so we can probably find uh, some uh, carbon crystals. Maybe it's around here somewhere, let's use uh, Sidu. Ah, he's not picking up anything. So I believe I found most most of these um, unmarked things, uh, but I don't remember this one. <clears throat> but yeah, let's just be careful and uh, try to use the animus pulse to detect anything nearby. Just looks like normal loot. Well, no matter. It's not that big of a deal. Bayek didn't even flinch. <clears throat> ah, most of the, yeah, I sort of knew that would happen.
<clears throat> I remember I, I used to hate that the enemies um, are so so good at detecting you in this game, but uh, um, really it's it's okay because uh, you have sleep darts which are pretty overpowered in my opinion. Uh, overpowered in a good way, I guess. <clears throat> Uh, because uh, you do need them to uh, sneak effectively. You can sneak without them, but um, in big forts with many enemies, it's very difficult to keep track of uh, everything you need to keep track of to be undetected. One more hippo looks like. Oh, I got disoriented. <clears throat> are they called hippos or are they called tank puppies? Thank you, good sir. <clears throat> My need is great. Oh, this is an anchorage. <clears throat> I usually don't bother to uh, stealth these locations, but uh, I do want to try and see if I can get this one. The anchorages are usually possible without too much hassle. Can I just get him now? Let's wait until the guy on the, on the other boat turns around. We might be able to get him hassle free. Indeed we can. <clears throat> Alright. Back to being sneaky. <clears throat> oh, we don't have any, uh, any arrows. Let's be careful with our tool usage as well. Is the nearest arrow wreck? Nothing here. Anyway, let's release the uh, the lines if we can.
I start with this. Uh, what are they called? I forget what they're called. <clears throat> anyway, I'm no good with them. And look at that, we can craft. Alright. We definitely want more tools before we get uh, more arrows. Sweet. And now let's just uh, work our way from the south to the north. Uh, we can get the stranger as well. But that will take us into Memphis. And we are not quite ready to go into Memphis yet. <clears throat> so let's just do these two locations. They're pretty close. <coughs> oh, this damn cough. This is per happy in the way when we yeah, some of these locations are difficult to pronounce. This looks like a cozy little village. Some carbon crystal, that's definitely worth it. How am I doing for carbon crystals? Uh, let's see. Yeah, not too bad. I do need more eventually. But for now the bottleneck for um, upgrading things are uh, iron and um, pelts. I guess I actually maybe should pay a little bit more attention to uh, <clears throat> where the upgrade materials are. Not going out of my way to hunt them, but um, maybe check once in a while. So let's see. Ah, there's some iron. That's great. And there also. They're traveling away from me. Let's just make sure we don't travel too far outside the area. Actually, let's go get the uh, iron ram. Uh, how many smoke points do we have? We are full up. That's great. That is excellent. And we'll beat them, hopefully no problem. <clears throat> wow, 
Oh boy. These are tough guys. Damn it. I was a bit lucky there. Now let's go chase him down. <clears throat> Swing and a miss. Just make a beeline for him. Can we can chop him to him one foot? Yes. <clears throat> Let's go get him. Hey, what? Too late to run now, idiot. Let's see if we can keep him stun stun lock. Oh. Down to the ground you go. Let's play a little game, shall we? No mercy. And we got smoke and mirrors. An excellent predator bow. So that'll definitely be an upgrade. Yeah, see, more stealth damage has a critical hit rate and it's on fire. <clears throat> All right, so let's. Did we go too far south? No, 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 we didn't. That's great. All right, let's get the. Let's grab the viewpoint quick <clears throat> before we continue exploring. I don't know why, but it's just so satisfying walking around this place with all the doves flying around and
Now what kind of materials are you guys carrying? Dangerous game here. Alright, what can we craft? Oh, sweet. Hidden blade upgrade. About time. Sabotage the Brazier before we do anything else. Brazier, I guess it's called. The Brazier is something else. All right, <clears throat> let's continue clearing out this area. <clears throat> and I think, um, I feel there hasn't happened too much in this stream. We haven't uh, really completed too many side quests and we're just clearing out areas. Uh, before, uh, before our, um, well, before continuing with the main quest. <clears throat> but yeah, I do like to play methodically and uh, clearing things behind me before moving on. <clears throat> That's why I'm, I will also be properly leveled when uh, I get to more difficult areas. I guess it will technically be over leveled, but uh, this is nightmare difficulty, so <clears throat> I guess there's no such thing as too leveled.
Right, we won't chase the stranger. Not into Memphis. Uh, but let's go get this Ptolemy statue. And let's actually not fast travel, let's see if we can find some pelts. Because we do need those. Oh, by the way, here you can see uh, Memphis in, in all its glory. Going to work and getting some dinner. Alright, Dutch, thanks for uh, hanging out. And uh, have a great evening. I do look forward to going into Memphis. It's a big city. It's beautiful. It's got it's got ton of uh, secret passageways, and uh, it's one of the more interesting cities in the game. Not my favorite, I guess, but uh, very pretty in any case. Let's see, could we spot any pelts somewhere? Hard leather... Wood... No, I don't see too many pelts around this area. Iron. Don't mind if I do. Should we aggro them? Nah, they're stopping. That's actually great. Uh oh, I'm probably dead. I think that was very lucky, <laughs> but I'm not complaining. I'll take it. Right, yes, we did actually clear everything to the south of us. Let's continue north. A few more locations to clear. Well, actually, a lot. I think one of those is a pretty big fort. Now, maybe this is easier to do on foot if I can stun the horses with smoke bombs.
this looks like a smaller camp. Should clear it pretty quickly. Standing in a pretty tall bush. <laughs> Wait a minute. Careful now. All right, not a problem. We are making good progress. Uh, although I must admit I'm looking forward to getting on with the uh, main quest. <laughs> uh, clearly this, these locations is a little bit boring, I know. <clears throat> oh, I remember this crossroads. It's a really busy one. So there will be tons of enemies here. The upside is we will get uh, a lot of crafting materials. See what I mean? I just keep coming. Damn it. No, 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 no. I'm so dead. Terrorizing the peasants. Anything? Hey! <laughs> Saved by a tiny pole. I think my I think my first um, chain assassination hit the horse and knocked him off. Oh, gotta be more uh, aware with my 
What the hell is happening? Why are they not... Why are they not detecting me? This is strange. And there's Fangs. Hello. Thanks, Fangs. Is this everybody for now? See, there are somebody else coming. Let's just dis dispatch them from a, a distance. That seems like a good idea. Seeing how dangerous they are. <clears throat> crafting available after all that oh well I guess uh, they weren't carrying iron I do have a lot of other things hmm. all right we are getting there That was a slaughter. I missed him. <clears throat> no matter. Well, I've forgotten to um, check out my gear for quite some time. <laughs> we might actually have something uh, other we want to use. No, the composite bow is great for now. What about swords? This is level 20. Uh, we should have something better. Maybe another weapon type. Level 26. Yeah. I do like my health on kill though. Yeah, let's go with the hack and slash. It's a downgrade in quality, but it uh, ah, doesn't matter. Maybe we should do another upgrade run as well. <clears throat> Seeing as we're not using uh, the gold for anything else. Now, I'm not entirely sure, but I believe a side quest will send us to uh, this fort anyway. Sorry. We'll hold off on that for a little while.
We are ever nearing the uh, pyramids in Giza. Yeah, I don't want to deal with this fort right now. Let's actually just sell everything. And we are uh, swimming in cash. So I guess it's time to... Just sell everything we don't need. I think I'll keep everything rare and above. For now at least. We don't really need any more money, I think. We can upgrade everything we want. Yes, all right. uh, but we will hold off on upgrading until we're level 28. Which should be just around the corner. Yes, all right. uh, so I explained in the previous stream um, that um, uh, we won't disassemble anything because we do get all the crafting materials we need anyway uh, and we don't really need money except uh, to upgrade things so I think uh, that's what we'll use the money on if I need more money I'll sell rare equipment as well there's no um, there's no yes, carry right. capacity in this game, so we can carry however much we we want. Fair yes, all right. oh, we are carrying a lot of stuff. <laughs> Pack rats. This game is missing a um, mark as junk feature. The inventory system in uh, basically all these RPG titles, they uh, can use some improvement. So, what do we want to upgrade? Well, oh yeah, we're gonna... Let's just uh, go ahead and uh, level up to level 28 before we do that. Hello, Red Arm. I heard tell of a local man who went missing. Being a generous man, I would be very happy if you were to find him. For the village, of course, not because he is one of my informants. Oh, he's near <coughs> nearby. Let's just go get him. <clears throat> He's right down the road. Down by the river. Actually, down in the river. This is the man Reda spoke of. Why position get it? It's hard to hear this passing, but good news for you. His weapon was made for him special. Perhaps... We got the Forlorn Hope. The arrival of this weapon on the battlefield means that death is close behind. Should we start using that? I guess why not? 
I don't really like heavy blades, but uh, well, uh, I want that to be my secondary. Actually, uh, and let's see what we're doing next with ability points. Uh, this is a good one. Arrow attacks. I do want the overpower chain throw. It costs three ability points. Yeah, I guess we'll save for that. Now then, let's upgrade the golden wolf. Four thousand. Yeah, we can easily afford that. Not a problem. And. I do want to have um, a dual sword ready, but we don't have any legendary ones. And it's a waste of time to upgrade the ra rare ones anyway. I mean, in a way, it's uh, a waste of time to upgrade anything before you reach the level cap. But uh, this is nightmare difficulty, so I do need uh, my weapons in tip top shape. Uh, I guess the only other thing I want is my composite bow up to my current level Which will help a little bit at least And the predator bow well, it's not too under leveled. I do I do one shot most things uh, With the headshots Yeah, I think I'll wait a little bit but we'll get more HP by upgrading the shield. Yeah, I want to. There we go. All right. Just a few more locations to clear. And uh, I am getting uh, a little bit tired, so. <coughs> I will end the stream after clearing the locations. This tree is a fine spot to conduct our business. No one will think to look up here. Here is the equipment you've asked for. Our military encampment receives new weapons and gear regularly. Keep the Drachnas coming, and I'll supply you with anything you need. All right. Sorry for disturbing your sleep. Don't mind me. Just passing through.
be seen in this area. Hmm. I put all the horses to sleep as well. It's a little bit funny. It feels a little bit dirty to put everybody to sleep and then just off them one by one. Just the statue of Ptolemy left, I guess. Okay, then I think we've uh, cleared out everything we were supposed to. Yeah. It looks like it. Yeah, we've been methodical. <laughs> so, uh, this has been Let's Play Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, we didn't do too much this uh, playthrough. Uh, basically just made sure we didn't leave any location uh, undone behind us in the Ineb Hedget Gnome. Uh, we did leave this fort, uh, the Kerkasaurus outpost, uh, because there's a side quest which will send us there eventually anyway. So, uh, thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.